Invest Insights. I'm Abby Malone. I'm joined today by Heather Hansen, the president of Biomed SA. Heather, thank you so much for being with me today. It's a pleasure to be here. Let's begin. As an engineer, you've designed products and equipment resulting in over 20 U.S. patents for a variety of medical technologies. This clearly indicates that there's always room to grow and work to be done. In what areas do you see the most potential for growth and improvement in health and bioscience? Well, there are many complex medical issues still to be solved, and they lend themselves to cross-functional teams and solutions. Huge gains can be made by combining technologies and applications. For example, a medical device that also includes biologics or pharmaceuticals in that combination can really help to solve um, those complex problems. However, there is still room for the clever, simple solution that resolves a burdensome procedure or process. Is to help accelerate the healthcare and bioscience sectors. What are some of the most exciting and significant innovations being implemented? Well, we are focused on the backbone of growth, the entrepreneurs. We hosted the first in-person BioFest Invest in San Antonio, a large event designed to connect entrepreneurs and investors, as well as providing educational programming and resource connections for the entrepreneurs. Through this event, we give entrepreneurs a step up toward their growth. We, we also routinely meet with companies to find out what their needs are and connect them to the resources they need to grow. This can be anything from who can perform a particular assay to how to uh, find an intern. In the interest of helping the healthcare and bioscience sector and the community, we put together a team to analyze the clinical trials subsector. We are currently fundraising to implement the team's recommendation for a clinical trial hub to connect all companies working in clinical trials and the community so that everyone can have access to clinical trials and influence cutting edge medical innovations. This is key to improving outcomes for all people of all ethnic backgrounds. The nationwide labor shortage is apparent in the healthcare and bioscience industries, with the past two years taking a heavy toll on the workforce that was already being stretched thin across an aging baby boomer population. What innovative creative tactics are you implementing to capture and retain talent? Well, we are putting together economic development organizations, industry, and educators to develop life science career information for students and adults to help them pick resilient careers in our industry. Most people pick their careers based on friends and family, and we can widely distribute the career information we're creating to break the poverty cycle and help people navigate the training process. We do a lot to connect people to others that have something in common. Cost of living, quality of life, and relationships are important to talent retention. San Antonio already has the low cost of living and high quality of life. So Biomed SA is focused on helping people connect with others with a common interest. We host targeted networking meetings around specific medical applications and common job functions. We also convene industry working groups to accomplish particular goals, all with the idea of helping people connect and build those relationships to retain the talent that we've already grown in San Antonio. To round out our discussion today on creativity, how would you define creativity and what does that look like for Biomed SA and the industry moving forward? Well, creativity is the ability to think about solving a problem in a unique way. Obviously that includes innovation, but it's more than that. It's also overcoming the fear that the solution may not work. It might be too difficult to implement, or more personally, it might be rejected by others. Mm -hmm. I believe that all industries can benefit from an injection of creativity and workplaces should be supportive of that. At Biomed SA, that means new programs and initiatives every year to support growth and promote the region. Well, thank you so much, Heather. No problem, I appreciate the opportunity. I was Heather Hansen, the president of Biomed SA. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel to hear more CEOs and thought leaders share their opinions and advice on the current business climate. Until next time, I'm Abby Maloney, and this has been Invest Insights. Thanks for tuning in.